Hi, it's Gabe from All Star Telescope. Today we're going to be unboxing and getting our first looks at the new ish Sea Star S30. It's the smaller and lighter and more portable version of their very popular Sea Star S50. Oh, yeah. I thought the camera guy was just pointing at me and like saying good job. No, it's back there. See? It's smaller. Let's dive in, shall we? Alright. Oh wow! It comes with a whole bunch of stickers. That's cute. Looks like it comes in more of a neoprene travel bag style case, whereas the S50 came in a bit more of a foam, kind of, you know, the squeaky kind of foam. It's nice, and it, it holds everything, but I like this a little bit better. Alright, snack for later. Um, this is the tripod that it comes with. It's very small, but thankfully it's made out of solid aluminum. Um, here's the main unit. Even smaller than the S50, which was already a very small little portable unit. Feels like it's made out of maybe glass fiber reinforced plastic. I know it's a bit hard to tell from just the temperature feel, but it feels like sturdier housing than the S50. I've just brought out the S30 for a bit of a direct size comparison. And indeed, it is a fair bit smaller. Um, I think also worth noting is the actual travel case itself. This is something that you would like fit inside your you know, bag, and this is something that you would carry alongside your bag, I feel like. Um, yeah, they've done a very good job in making it a lot more compact and honestly feels a fair bit sturdier. No, I don't want to say a fair bit sturdier. Mm -hmm. First impressions are, feels a fair bit more solid than the uh, S52. Uh, it's not to say that the S50 feels cheap or anything, this just feels more dense. It feels dense and it's got some heft. It's got not girth, but mass to it. Um, the tripod that it comes with it does indeed feel quite sturdy. I know that leveling is a pretty important part of the alignment procedure, and that might be a bit harder still considering you can't extend or shorten the length of these legs. Um, so I am happy to announce that at least the leveler that we have as part of our accessories for the S50 does work for the S30 as well. It's the same male and female thread at the bottom of the tripod here. And it looks a lot cooler too. All right, I'm gonna set this aside while we go through. Inside the box, you have space for the solar filter, the instructions, or looks like you can take that out and make even more room for some 3D printed accessories that we'll be making shortly. Not right now, They're, it's a different size to the S30. You can store those here as well, alongside the solar filter and the instructions, but nobody reads those. And inside the main chamber where the S30 and the tripod lives also comes with a good USB-C cable for you to charge it or leave it powered on, download your photos onto your computer. But yeah, you can keep that inside the mesh part if you want. All right, well, I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow where we'll hopefully get to take this thing for a spin.